Tuesday's Loudoun County School Board meeting brought lines of people waiting to get inside as parents got to voice their thoughts on policies to recognize transgender students. Please do what you can for transgender students. They need the support for their school board and administration now more than ever. To force policies that restrict our freedoms is beneficial to no one. The meeting came as the district finds itself in a court battle against a local teacher, originally put on administrative leave for controversial comments on transgender students. On Tuesday, the tension could be seen and heard. I wanted to take the time. <laughs> The meeting brought multiple warnings about crowd reactions until public comments came to an abrupt end and brought an uproar. I am disgusted by your bigotry and your depravity. The motion carries 9-0. Public comment is now ended. We will move to our next agenda item. This cell phone video captures the response as some opponents of the transgender policies called for the ouster of some school board members. Loudoun County deputies later announced the arrest of one man for disorderly conduct and resisting arrest, while another man faced charges for trespassing after refusing to leave. All this took place as supporters from both sides gathered outside the Loudoun County School Board building. Uh, to be able to educate teachers like Mr. Cross and make sure they understand the gravity of what it means to reaffirm our students' identities, um, that is the goal. The other side just wants it only kind of one way, but if you really look at the way they go after things, it's our way or we're going to attack you. Out. Policies involving transgender students bringing emotional debate with the school board scheduled to vote on the issues in early August. Tom Dempsey, WUSC. Hey, John, walk with me, please. John, walk with me, John. Now! Hey, John, please don't resist. Please don't resist. You guys, don't resist. This, is a, this is an unlawful arrest. I have a First Amendment right. Listen, listen, listen. You, you do. Right. You're right. Okay, thank you. Here's so someone so speaking rationally. Listen, listen to me. At this point, the meeting is over, right? It's not over. Listen, it's listen. not over. We were right. meeting. We but were meeting. If you that's a parent there at a school board meeting in Virginia getting arrested while protesting against critical race theory and a transgender policy. Loudoun County in Virginia has been in the headlines the last few weeks after multiple parents were filmed addressing the student's school board on issues they didn't agree with. Today, a school board meeting got out of control when the crowd became rowdy, resulting in two reported arrests and a minor injury for one person. According to Reuters reporter Gabriella Borta, the local county sheriff's office declared the school board meeting an unlawful assembly. Parents were told to get out of the room or they would be trespassing. The meeting was mainly to discuss a proposed policy 8040, which is a transgender protection right for students. In May, a Virginia physical education teacher was suspended from his job for refusing to invoke the policy by using a student's pronouns, citing it was sinning against God. While the teacher was eventually reinstated to his job, it has been wildly criticised by conservative parents, especially when over 250 Loudoun County residents signed up to speak at today's meeting. Critical race theory was not meant to be on the agenda for today's meeting, but became a priority, according to Gabriella Borta. While the crowd became chaotic during proceedings, the board decided to halt public commentary, which angered the crowd, who started singing the Star Spangled Banner. I'll be 